All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be factoring the expression x to the power of four plus 16. <clears throat> so this might look a little complicated because we have a power of four, but don't let that scare you. This is actually more simpler than you might think. So what I'm gonna first do is rewrite this as x to the power of two times two plus four squared. Now, a to the power of m times n is equal to a to the power of m to the power of n. So x to the power of 2 times 2 turns into x to the power of 2 to the power of 2. And 4 squared, we're just going to keep that the same. Now, if I have something in the form a squared plus b squared, this is equal to a plus b squared minus 2ab because a plus b squared is equal to a plus b times a plus b, which if you distribute a, distribute b, you get a squared plus ab plus ab plus b squared, which is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. So because a plus b squared is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared, this means that a squared plus b squared is equal to a plus b squared minus 2ab. So because if you subtract the 2ab, all that's left is a squared plus b squared. So this means that for x squared squared plus 4 squared, this is the same thing as x squared plus 4 squared. 4 squared squared minus 2ab, which is 2 times x squared times 4. And this is the same thing as 2 root 2x squared. And if I have something in the form a squared minus b squared, this is equal to a plus b times a minus b. So this turns into x squared plus 2 root 2x plus 4 times x squared minus 2 root 2x plus 4. So this is the factored version of my expression. Thank you guys for watching. Please make sure to subscribe, leave a like, and share this video. Bye.